Yo, what's up guys? It's Eli here. My fiance Megan and I were heading down to Self Defined Pro Fitness in Denver, Colorado. Badass gym down there. We're gonna go and hit some uh, hamstrings and some shoulders. A lot of supersets, a lot of job sets. And you get to see my hot fiance. All right, we'll see you guys there. All right, so here we're a couple sets into uh, shoulder presses, and we just hit two warm-up sets of about 20, 25 reps on a lightweight. Now we're bumping up a little bit heavier, and the plan here is we're going to hit some shoulder presses, and then drop down and superset with uh, lateral raises. So, again, I think this is like my second or third set. So I'm gonna bust these out as many as I can. Again, my whole thing is hitting failure, all right? And here we're gonna drop set. So what I was trying to do, I was just trying to blast out the muscle as much as possible, okay? So I rarely just do one and done sets. You know, typically, with the majority of my sets, I am hitting double drop sets or triple drop sets in addition to super sets. So here I started 80s, drop down, I think those were 60s or 40s. Now I'm gonna go and hit some lateral raises. All right, now here we're going into a standing hamstring curl. If your gym has one of these, definitely use it guys. Provides uh, just crazy amount of tension on your hamstring here. And you can train it just like a bicep. So it's real fun, I'll do like 21s on here like you would with the standard bicep curl. Really good exercise to pre-fatigue the muscle. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna go from this into a partial uh, stiff-legged deadlift. Partial meaning just partial range of motion. So we're going all the way down, coming about 80-90% of the way up. And this is gonna keep tension on your hamstring and just blast out those hams and glutes. For you girls out there, definitely try this machine. This hits your glutes like crazy. Just get on a regular uh, abduction machine, uh, sit reverse on it, and push out with your knees, and you'll really feel that hit uh, your glute and hamstring where they come together and meet. Hits it really, really well. Now, when you're doing this exercise, it's real important that you guys use good strict form. Keep your abs real tight. Raise up, activating your front delts, and then use good control coming down. It's really easy to cheat on this one, so make sure you guys are watching how much weight you're pushing. All 
All right, now moving into one of my favorite isolators for the delts, the leaning side raise. What this does is puts a ton of pressure on that side delt. It makes it real hard to cheat. Generally with this one, I'll go lighter weight and go really high rep just to get ridiculous pump in that delt. Now coming up here, what we're gonna do, we're gonna hit a superset with reverse cable flies. Now what I've done here, I've found two long handles and put them on a single cable. This gives you a ton of range of motion. Definitely don't go heavy on this one. I'll just maybe have it on 20 or 30 pounds and hit about 20 reps and then drop set and hit about another 20 reps. And the pump this gives you in your rear delts is sick. Mm -hmm. 